Well, we are on our way. We are going to be doing our one of our biggest legs of the trail. Um, <laughs> and it's been a few months since we've walked, so we're going to go real hard on 10 miles. Yeah. I don't know what the hell we're thinking, but I think we'll be fine. Um, a lot of it's minor over matter, but um, we are going to be doing the Caesars Creek leg of the trail. This is just the Caesars Creek part, state park area. We are going to be staying at the campground and we're going to be doing back-to-back -back hiking. So, we're going to do tonight and then tomorrow morning. It's going to be, it's going to be interesting. Wish us luck. Hey, we are back here again. We're starting our Caesar Creek leg um, of the Buckeye Trail. Uh, <laughs> let me just tell you, it's, I'm not sure where we go. <laughs> Cause if this is what the trail is telling us to do. Okay. We're going to get ticks. <laughs> We are so screwed up. So we are um, doing, like I said, the, the Caesar Creek um, trek of the trail. Uh, we're gonna do 10 miles today. I think maybe 10.2. And then we're going to hit up maybe 10 tomorrow. Oh my God, it's overgrown real bad. <laughs> For tennis shoes, she said. I'm tennis shoes. I'm just glad that I wore some long pants. Yeah, Long-ish. Huh. So. Um. Oh, there's some poop there, like a big old log. Um. You know what though? Poop happens, right? Dear Lord, wish us luck. All right, so. Apparently, apparently we're, we're on a horse trail. This is where the horses come. And we're right by the, the river, which is nice. Um, but I have a feeling it's gonna get a little, I have a feeling it's gonna get a little skeet here. But you know what? As long as she's in front, she's gonna catch the spider webs. This is really cool. This is kind of what we've been wanting for like the whole trail. A lot of it's been city and rural roads. This is definitely with the, with the exclusion of a couple of the metro parks. This has been the most trail-ish, like wilderness trail. So. And I'm going to try my hardest to not bounce this around. Um, yeah. All right. Stay tuned. Well, we almost went all the way that way. Uh, yeah. So it has that, but that's for oncoming. So we actually go this way. That could have been a little treacherous. I do have gut hooks, um, but I haven't checked in a while because it's pretty well marked on this trail. Even there's just a lot of this mud and horse trail and whatnot. So, fun, fun. Check out this. Came up on 
some uh, sunflower field. How cool is that? The birds have gone to town on them. They are no longer sunflowers. They're ground flowers. They're not reaching for the ground. Or they're not reaching for the sun. <sighs> well, it was a little sketchy back there. Lots of spider webs. And ain't nobody like spider webs. So, we like these little breaks that we get in the field. Snack time. We're at four and a quarter, four and three quarter miles. And, and, um, There's so much mud on the trail. Um, so much mud on the trail from horses, because we're technically kind of like on a horse trail. And it's back and forth, back and forth, mud, just mud pits. And um, the spiders, the cobwebs are wicked. But it looks like there's like been a horse trail or a horse on it. Um, pretty fresh, I would say maybe within the last day or so. Mm -hmm. um, we just saw a hum hummingbird coming down here to this little boat dock area. Um, we have been seeing like paw prints of like something wicked huge huge coyote cat something, something. but a couple of birds nothing crazy i really like seeing the hummingbird though lots of butterflies in the prairie areas but we're just taking a break All right, just came up on cemetery. Oh, uh, I have no idea. I have no idea where the cemetery is at all. Could be down there somewhere, but as of right now, there's none. But there's a lot of this shit. Dude, this is, we are so, oh god that was a bug i just pissed myself <laughs> um there's so much of this <gasps> oh my god it's so bad we are slowed down tremendously because of it like it's so bad like this okay put some more of this tarp in, or something <laughs> Oh, bugs. All right, we go that way. I think the cemetery is up that way or some. That's a little sketchy. Oh my god. Yeah, it's a nice plummet. We've just been dealing with this shit constantly. Constantly. And. We were just, we're just over it. We're ready for some sangria. Yeah. So I guess that was the bridge. I don't know what we just went over. And then, I don't know, but we have to haul ass and get back to camp because we still have under five miles, probably. close to four and a quarter. Well, we came across the cemetery. Um, we are losing daylight, otherwise, I'd say we go, but 
We can't. Oh, we just busted out of two miles in like, what, 30 minutes or something like that? We hauled ass. Um, now we're on the road. Just feel like maybe a service road of some sort? No, not at all. I wonder how far it goes. Probably not that far. We couldn't get that lucky, but um, we are definitely feeling the stint of seven miles so far. Almost eight. Almost eight. And yeah, <clears throat> it's been a while since we've been on the trail. So. Tomorrow's gonna be a little tough. <sighs> That's gorgeous. How you doing back there? We're almost there. Almost. It's getting a little dark, but we are so close. Hanging in there? Yep. So the trail wouldn't have been as bad as it is if there wasn't giant mud pits. So overall it was a pleasant trail, Ooh, but like excluding the mud pits. So right now we're on this levee. Look at that, there's the moon up there. I think we have open road. From here which would be awesome because we've had to bust out lanterns like had to use them back there in that trail I it was a little sketchy you ready to do it again tomorrow I don't know yet. <laughs> in the morning. couple ibuprofen later all right just to kind of give you an idea just how dark it is. Oh my God. Uh, it's pretty dark. We just made it to our end point. Um, yeah. Bee's not feeling good. That was pretty intense. At one point we were nearly right at the end and like all of a sudden the trail just kind of went somewhere and we had to like navigate around it. It was pretty fucking scary. So yeah, now I just gotta find my Jeep cause it's so dark. I think it's over there. It is dinner time. We're making some hobo meals. So usually okay. people, usually people make um, like foil packets and I came up with the inventive idea of putting it in a pie pan. Mm -hmm. Then we're just gonna wrap foil over it and put it over our luscious fire that we have over there. Um, today was rough. <laughs> uh, we clocked at like four hours and like 40 minutes. It was too long, way too long. We usually get done with 10, 10 miles in, um, what is that? Three hours, maybe a little over. It was how much we're checking the scenery. Yeah, it was quite but we're showered, we feel much better. Um we're gonna we're gonna do this, so exciting for day one.